Oh, well, we haven't seen them all, but um, no. So uh, why why did you decide to, to ask him about his motion? Uh, because they're ridiculous. The, the tree one, for example, you saved so much money. And the whole problem where we were in the situation with the ice storm is because we didn't invest enough in forestry for pruning and, and preventative. When you when you deal with things on a preventative measures, then you save money in the end. And he's all about saving the taxpayers' money. Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, do you, were you hoping to actually convince him of your point of view? <laughs> I'm an eternal optimist, so I, I feel I can educate people, especially on the environment. Mm-hmm. Obviously, lost cause with him. And what do you think about his strategy of, of introducing all the motions today at, uh, at council instead of uh, previously in the budget process? I don't, I don't, um, I'm not able to understand how he works. Do you think it's a genuine effort on his part to, what do you think his motivation is? I think if he's genuine, he would have gone around and and spoken to council colleagues and tried to get support and be the bridge builder that we need a mayor to be. And what do you think, of? he seems very angry now that his motions, he couldn't read them all out at a time, what's what's your reaction to that? He needs to take Toastmasters and learn how to be succinct. (laughs) Thanks, Councillor. Thank you, Councillor. That's all. What he asked you was exactly what we could ask you. Enjoy your work. Thank you.